Welcome to Villa Maggio, Frank Sinatra's Palm Desert Hideaway. We're 4,300 feet above sea level which means that the weather up here is beautiful. The house, which was built like a mid-century lodge, is perched up here on top of the hill, overlooking epic panoramic views of the Coachella Valley. You see the lights light up from Desert Hot Springs all the way out, really almost down to Indio and further beyond. But it's really the ability to see the wildlife, the coyotes, mm -hmm. the hummingbirds. There is so much plant life. In terms of views, it gets magical. You really feel like you're in a piece of paradise. You know, you're seeing Mother Nature at her best. It's called Villa Maggio. And the reason it's called Villa Maggio is because Frank Sinatra won his Academy Award for playing Captain Maggio in From Here to Eternity. And this is really was Frank's playground during his bachelor days. Frank Sinatra's estate incorporates three different separate structures. You've got the main house, which is five bedrooms and five and a half bathrooms. You have a detached guest house, which is three bedrooms and five bathrooms. And additionally, you also have a pool house. Villa Maggio was designed to be both luxurious and comfortable. Frank had his blueprint on everything here. So from the way that the house was laid out, the privacy, the five-star accommodations for his dignitary friends. Princess Margaret has been here. Princess Grace Kelly has been here. And the A-listers, the Rat Pack, etc. It was an epic party house. Our clients just loved the property exactly the way it was, and they preserved it as a piece of iconic history. You walk around and you look in the kitchen, and you're going to see you know, the orange tile that Frank chose. You're gonna see in the guest bathroom the palm wallpaper that he chose. You're gonna see the built-ins that he specifically customized, which were to his exact specifications. One of the most interesting things has really been the secret passageway in the three-bedroom guest house. Some interesting other facts about it is Frank Sinatra uh, purchased the land in 1967. It took three years to build the property. There's a lighted helipad here. It's a 20 minute drive up the mountain, so a helipad is a nice thing to know that if you're a celebrity, you don't have to worry about that 20 minute drive. The things that, that stand out about this room are the entrance door and the wood paneling is, is gorgeous. You walk in, you see the naturally sourced stone of the fireplace, the 15 foot ceilings with the wood beams that came from the valley below. I think you'll really get a real good feel that you could see where they'd had the dancing and the music. I really think that when you look at this special property, it was all about Frank and his friends and having really a secluded place to party, have fun, and let your hair down without the public and the paparazzi looking down on you.